great question. I think uh, when you get into the business of coaching, you go into ultimately trying to grow and develop, uh, put yourself in a position to become that coach and your own program. And I've been fortunate to be around some great coaches that coached me and that I worked alongside. I think probably two of the best and uh, Hall of Fame coaches are James Dixon and Cal. You said Cal said this was the sleeping giant. Yes. Uh, what about it? I think just all those things that I mentioned earlier, uh, being able to recruit to a city like Tampa and with the commitment that, they've, that the administration has put into the program, all those variables lead to a program that can have success. How is this group still trying to finish this thing off? How have they been? How have they looked? Uh, they look great. They look great. They're, uh, they're working hard. They're still... Uh, crazy enough, still got room to grow, and uh, that's that's exciting. That's, that's, uh, we're trying to we're trying to push them every day. Really walked out of that locker room without pressure, no brace, no limp. But is that is that to keep the mystery alive, or is there any is there any hope for you guys in these plays? Uh, it's a it's a question that would I would prefer to Coach Cal. <laughs> You're a head coach now. <laughs> <laughs> not not yet. Not in this not in this setting. Not in this. <laughs> Uh, well, I've also recruited kids at Pittsburgh and in Memphis that uh, weren't always uh, top five picks or, or uh, down was all Americans like that. So you know, being able to recruit and identify the talent, I think that's it's still going to continue. I'd like to hopefully be able to have the problem uh, that we have here in Kentucky. That means we're winning a lot if we're doing that. <laughs> Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, getting a chance to see the talent uh, in a couple of the tournaments that I've been. There is, in basketball in general in the world, it's, it's catching up with its success, and the world is getting a lot smaller in terms of basketball. Orlando, is there anybody at Kentucky, staff or not, you might be looking at for your staff? Are there any guys you would consider taking with you? Um, maybe, maybe. Uh, just having... Uh, Dove into all the particulars of that right now. Uh, something that I'll sit down once we we settle down from uh, this current position. It's well documented. USF had offered the job to some other guys before you. Do you go in there with a little something to prove that you should have been the first choice? No, not really. Um, I think I was my wife's second choice too. So. <laughs> <laughs> but it's worked out. We've been together for over 20 something years. So. <laughs> Is there going to be a home and home in Kentucky now? Um, I hope so. I hope they'll eventually maybe work something out, but haven't even gotten that far down the line there. <laughs> Is the and home part the tougher part to talk down to? <laughs> it's always. <laughs> First you got, game you, at your place. Yeah, you guys know better than I do. <laughs>